We're going into another week of the governor's red zone recommendations. Only this time, 94 counties fall under that designation. LEX 18's Catherine Collins went to one of those new counties to look at the impact of those guidelines. 2020, a turbulent time to be in the restaurant business. Just the uncertainty, you know. But like so many others here at Bourbon on Main in Frankfurt, they just keep going. We just have to adapt. Literally just have to adapt. Assistant manager Jamar Moten says they've done everything they can to keep people safe while still providing a welcoming atmosphere. But they now face yet another challenge. Franklin County is one of the new counties on the red zone list this week, one of 94 Kentucky counties now. Governor Bashir recommends people in those communities avoid dining out. Disappointing, but just like everything else, Moten says they'll take it in stride. I do see maybe an increase uh, again on the to go orders or the curb size. Um, it's going to be a few people that's hesitant in coming out, which is totally understandable. The governor's red zone recommendations also call on people to avoid gathering with anyone outside their household and to work from home. We're going to live up to what we're asking uh, other people to do. The governor says here in Frankfurt, the largest employer is the state. He says state employees will be working from home as much as possible next week. Right now, the red zone guidelines are just that guidelines. Governor Bashir says he doesn't have plans for further mandates at this time. We are trying to to see right now um, how well these work, uh, how embraced uh, they are by the communities, and we are seeing some real significant buy-in. Moten says he's confident people in Franklin County will still support restaurants. Just a caring, loving community. Uh, nobody want to see anybody down. In whatever form that takes, in Franklin County, Katherine Collins, LEX 18 News.